take three and we're going to pretty much wrap this segment up. We were here at the 55 in Edinger. I'm looking for radio positions and it's come to my attention that Honda sponsors pretty much almost everything in their mom and all the shows. And I don't want my past to affect my future with my jobs and what I want to do, which is broadcasting big games, sports games. And the reason that I'm upset is they did break the law. I know it, you know it. And the media didn't do their jobs on finding out some of the details. Now I'm gonna let this all go behind me and it's not gonna make anything better. We're not gonna go and reopen right next door like they should. According to the law, it says all properties returned. If you can prove that the two collaborated or more than one person did, violate your constitutional rights which were trying to force set a business which was one strong hand another strong hand and then the judicial branch but then the lying in court there's no construction there's no sales of the cars they said and that's the point they lied they got away with it and now i'm trying to move on trying to get my new jobs i'm just going over there to micro center asking him regarding um what it's going to take to go work over there and there's a background check, a criminal check, all these freaking checks. So that's on my resume, 15 years DJing and I used to manage, it's my dad's place, it was our business since 19 whenever. And I got to always explain well what happened over there and people don't want to ex hear your explanation for what happened with Honda because Honda's a sponsor. Personally, I'll just get Honda, Toyota or another sponsor, I don't care. But the fact that they can get away and say, act like they're so great, when that occurred, it's, it's lying. It's flat out lying. So I want to know if corporate knew anything. And I don't think corporate's bad. Corporate's good. And I want to um, set the record straight and clear my name. And that's all. That's all I want. 